I am a comic book fan made good who uh, got a chance to work in the field that uh, I desired to since I was probably three years old. I've been uh, working in comics as a painter, which I was trained to be at the American Academy of Art in Chicago. The comics that I've done since I was 19 have been all painted illustration, and uh, that's kind of my gimmick within the art form. And I still use actual paints on actual paper and airbrush and everything mixed in. Given the number of years I've been working in comics, I've built up a lot of these things as being very special to my way of working to get as photographic and as realistic as possible. So it is in very similar keeping with the way they worked on Mortal Kombat, but um, very uh, prehistoric by standards of working with the computer. Even though I'm going from reference of my own initial drawing building up to a final painted finish, I am looking closely at all the reference I was provided for the game to see if there's anything more I can pick up on that's being done with these three-dimensional models that have an infinite layer of detail. You know, everything from hair to leather finish and seeing how many of those textures can I actually incorporate into the final painting. I went to a lot of extremes to try and do that with even illustrating the weave of Sonya's shirt, putting all the sort of cracks and detail that's in the armor of Scorpion, the chainmail of Raiden, these things I wanted to show that like, hey, I can do it too, but my way is going to still be done by a hand holding a brush, and I was trying to measure up to all those details that were created for the game. The original sketch I did is it's extremely tight and I follow that as closely as possible. Then going into the painted stage, uh, it's almost like I've got a picture in my mind where I know exactly what it should turn out like and I'm comfortable now with where it's going to go. I try and use the airbrush sparingly so it doesn't really overwhelm or completely take away from the human hand side of things and that's hopefully what I'm completing at the end is something that feels like it was the process of an organic gestation, something that feels very natural and real. And I was very pleased with the result of the final piece.